Okay, I quickly just wanted to look at how to um, create a shape file in Geosoft and how to export it. And so what I've got today is the outline of a grid area that I'm looking at and I want to export that to, as a shape file so I can import it into QGIS. So here's my magnetic map on the right hand side. Here is a database and these are the, the four points of my survey area. Um, you can see when I click on them here it actually shows up on the map. This last point here is the first point repeated because I want to create a square and I want it to close the square. So now I'm going to go map tools, symbols, look sorry wrong line path <laughs> um, and I'm gonna create a, a square and I'm gonna just make sure my label size is really small here so I don't get a label and I click OK OK and you can see it's showing up as this box here what I'm gonna do now is go to the left hand side here to group manager tools and it's the group manager tools if I click on this grid and it shows me AGG is the magnetic data and the path is this outline. I'm going to click on path, I'm going to go map, export, I'm going to make sure my output format is shapefile, I'm going to make sure I've clicked here on selection because you only want to export the selected data. Dots per inch you can make it 300, I'm not sure how important that is. So it must say shapefile, must say selection. Click OK, click where you want to save it, so I'm going to call it survey save as tough is shape because we've selected already click save and now you can go and get your shape file and import it into ArcGIS or QGIS one thing to make sure in your survey area you've typed in all the coordinates and um, make sure that you've said what type of coordinate system you're dealing with so that it does plot it on the map so you would go coordinates coordinate system make sure you've selected X and Y here and then make sure you've defined your coordinate system. You'll know that this is the case because there's a small x and a small y that has appeared.